Roma celebrate the opening goal from Lorenzo Pellegrini Roma's bid to break into Serie A's top three at the halfway stage of the season was thwarted in part by two video assistant referee decisions as they drew 1-1 against Sassolo. Eusebio Di Francesco was leading the Giallarossi against his former employers and it was another man to have switched to the Stadio Olimpico, Lorenzo Pellegrini, who opened the scoring. After the break, Edin Dzeko thought he had scored his ninth goal this term but VAR decided he had been offside and, minutes later, Simone Miseroli leveled for Sassolo with a well-placed header. Alessandro Florenzi found the back of the net with five minutes remaining, only for VAR to intervene once more. The point left Roma just outside the Champions League spots. It also kept the side two points behind Inter Milan, who could only labor to a Saturday evening stalemate with Lazio at San Siero. Lazio's Chiro Immobile won a penalty in the second half but VAR overturned the referee's decision, with Marui Cardi heading just wide for Inter late on. In Saturday's late game, Paolo Dybala scored twice as Juventus beat Hellas Verona 3-1 away from home. Blaise Matuidi gave Juventus the lead early on before Martin Caceres leveled for the hosts but Diabala's second half double within six minutes gave the visitors all three points, taking them to within a point of leaders Napoli at the halfway stage of the season. Hawk and Cal, Anoglu spared AC Milan from ending the year with a defeat by scoring the equalizer in a 1-1 draw at Fiorentina. Giovanni Simeone's second-half header set Milan on a course to lose their third straight league match but Turkey international Cal, Anoglu acted quickly to salvage an away point. There was unbridled joy at Benevento's Stadio Ciro Vigorito on Saturday afternoon as the promoted club finally celebrated a first top-flight victory thanks to Massimo Cota's first strike of the campaign. Benevento had just one point on the board after 18 games but Cota sealed a 1-0 win over Kievo to spark the faintest glimmer of hope they will be able to battle for survival in 2018. Massimo Cota, right, scored the winning goal for Benevento on Saturday Kevin Lasagna scored his fifth goal in as many matches as Udinese recovered to triumph 2-1 at Bologna. Daniela's own goal gave the Rossa Blue the upper hand before the half-hour mark but defender Sylvan Widmer leveled with a bullet header. Following the interval, Lasagna slotted Rodrigo de Paul's pass home to lift Udinese above Milan. Ten-man Colliery held on to claim a 2-1 success over Atalanta in Bergamo. Leonardo Pavoletti fired the Sardinians ahead with six minutes gone and Simone Pedoin tucked Diego Faria's cross away to give Colliery a comfortable lead. Right at the death, though, Alejandro Gomez slashed the deficit and sent him Miong's dismissal for a second bookable offense made for a tense finale. Sampdoria sustained their push for European football as Fabio Quagliarella scored two last gasp goals in a 2-0 home win against SPAL. The veteran striker broke the deadlock from the penalty spot when Emiliano Viviani brought down Gaston Ramirez and Quagliarella doubled up from a David Kaunaki assist in the dying seconds. Elsewhere, Torino and Genoa ground out a goalless draw.